what's up guys welcome back to another episode to another random looking game wounded summer baby you play as a baby who's on a perilous journey to find your sister if it's anything like gears of babies that i played then i'm sure we're gonna be in for a massive treat so let's take a look tecumseh is a baby from the red cloud tribe according to the custom of this tribe newborns who have reached nine months to go to the forest alone and do their first hunt. Well, I'm very surprised that baby is walking at nine months. I'm not saying babies don't walk at nine months, but that's quite early. Recently, white people have come to the land of Red Cloud and found minerals there. The head of the white has offered to buy the land, but the chief of the Red Cloud tribe does not accept. To come, Sir goes on his first hunt in the woods. He must prove that he is a baby and can hunt alone. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. I say blah, blah, blah. I'm probably going to forget in a minute, right? What, what, what are the... There we go. Hunt two deer. Imagine a nine-month-old going out to hunt deer with a bow and freaking arrow. Okay. Right. Let's do our first... What happens if we go in the water? Will I drown? No. I would have liked if there's like a splash effect, but... Also, I feel the mouse is a little bit... Jittery. Like, it's a little bit... Maybe too sensitive, right? Where, where, where are the deer? I has not seen any deer. Oh, is this baby gonna clamber? Okay, up you get, up you get. I like the fact um, it has kind of added some obstacles. Um, ah, beautiful. Obviously, navigate. Uh, whereas call of um, call of babies, frick sake, baby. Uh, Gears of Babies didn't quite have this. Obviously, it was a very different kind of game where you had guns or it's this one you've got. Oh, just get the frick up. You've got... Oh, my freaking God, baby. Um, Don't look at me like that. Obviously, in this one, you've got... Don't. I find the, the, the arrow so... Sen the arrow? The mouse is so sensitive. If I turn it slightly, it just really takes me, of course, of where I want to come to the jump. I don't know if I'm actually pronouncing that name right. Go. Go, go, go. Aha! Oh, I missed. <laughs> that was a good shot, baby. Right, let's go. Ooh, what are you doing? Let's go and kill the other deer. Like babies do. Kill the. What the frick? A bear? Hang on. What bear? What frickin' bear? So it said hunt to do, now it's saying... Oh, okay. <laughs> did I kill it? I did not kill that bear. Killed the bear. Comes to returns to tribe after hunting. He is happy that he was able to prove his ability. What now? I have no task. I'm just running in like a mining car. Oh, am I returning home? I presume I'm returning home. There's my family. What's the noise for? What's the noise for? What's going on? Why is there a noise? Oh, I meant to kill you. I thought you were my family. You're not my family. What the fuck's going on with your hand, mate? I don't get what's going on with the freaking hands. Like, who runs like that? Oh, whatever. Not my hand. Look at him! Whatever. I don't know if he's dead. Oh, no. Okay. I feel this bow and arrow is maybe a little bit overpowered just because... They're not intelligent enough to shoot me from afar, so it is. I'm gonna. It is rather easy. Like he's just running. He's running really slow. 
I feel if they were a bit smarter, it would be a bit more of a challenge. But that's just obviously my opinion. <laughs> okay. It comes, it comes near a dying soldier and asks him why his tribe is attacked. The soldier of the wolf tribe replies that they are the chosen people of the gods. And in their ancient religious book, it is said that these lands belong to the wolf tribe thousands of years ago. Tecumseh then goes to the surviving woman and asks her about the rest of the tribe and her sister. The old woman answers that the girls of the tribe were taken to the wolf tribe land by their soldiers. Then the woman gives him the address. <laughs> Surely cannot call ordinance would have been better, not like... I'm just imagine like a postcode and everything of the wolf tribe that passes through the ruins okay obviously i know this game is trying to be funny so i'm guessing certain things are done in a way to make it just absolutely ridiculously unbelievable all right okay let's go and find the sister and the rest of the tribe i guess or at least our sister but right, how old is our sister oh no more obstacles for baby to deal with come on get up no, I missed that completely. Ooh, that took a lot of health. Does it regenerate? Does my health regenerate? I don't know. We'll have a look. We'll find out, won't we? It's because the mouse is a little bit, as I said, sensitive. Like, if I turn it... Okay. Didn't do it then, but I did it slowly. It doesn't seem like my health is regenerating, so I need to be careful so I'm not a dead baby. I can't see anyone. I'm guessing they just passed through here. No, my health is definitely not regeneration. I really need to be careful. Also, I like the fact um the way these obstacles are laid out, it's not it doesn't exactly tell you or highlight where you need to go, but the way obviously it's placed is quite obvious. So that's quite nice. Right, I don't need it. Alright, I do need to be careful because obviously if I fall like a prat that I usually am, then we're dead. Come on, baby. Come on, wounded summer baby. No. He didn't jump. I pressed spacebar, but he didn't didn't jump. Right, now we're back to where we were. Um, one thing that I do kind of, I know it's very different, but I do kind of get like a um Far Cry Primal kind of vibe, and I feel if certain elements of that were implemented, like maybe having different <sighs> I don't know, maybe I'm asking too much for obviously quite a simple game. I feel maybe the use of tomahawks or something like that would be really good. Um, you know, maybe a little bit more of a tribally kind of thing in the sense of having perks where you can track footsteps and things like that. But as I said, I think maybe I'm asking a bit too much for this kind of game. Finally, Tecumskin arrives at the wolf tribe and he prepares to take revenge and save his people. You do that, nine-month-old baby. You save everyone. The music's really freaking changed. I mean, I'm not too worried about any of these people posing like, any kind of threat. Just because... No, I can't see anyone for a start. Let's, let's, say, let's start with that. But also, the fact of this bow and arrow, that like, it takes three shots to kill them, and they don't try and kill you from afar. They just charge at you with, like, a wafty-looking hand. All right, let's get up the hill and... and observe the enemy. Oh, hey, buddy. Like the fact his friend doesn't give a toss. Well, you're next, buddy. You're so slow. Oh, there's another one there. Hey, you didn't die. Nah, you died. The music's a bit loud, but I really like the drums. It gives it that sort of more of an authentic -y kind of indian -y tribal kind of vibe to it, which I really like. I don't know if I got up there. Imagine maybe I go in there. I mean, I just can't imagine a baby climbing up a freaking ladder. Also, there was no enemies up there, so it led me to believe that this is the way I go. Alright. Let's 
get down and I'm guessing we go over there. I'm not too sure. Um, I'm guessing we go to this one because it's lit up. But then again, there's also another one over there that seems lit up. No, it's just directing us to the way we've got to go. Don't see anyone else. Yeah, I feel the bow and arrow is just a bit too easy or like if the AI were just that little bit smarter, I think it'd be that much more of a challenge. Who the frick's that up there? Now guess what, buddy, you're next. I managed to defeat me, nine month old baby. Managed to defeat all of your people. Except this one. But he's dead now. So it's just me and you, buddy. And he's dead. I don't know what he had. It looked like a different kind of weapon. After defeating the wolf chief, Tecumseh frees the imprisoned girls, but his sister is not among them. The girls tell him that his sister was taken away by the white men who are the accomplices of the wolf tribe. The whites gave weapons to the wolf tribe and asked them for our land in return. Tecumseh, who realises that their incitement caused these wars, goes to the white village to take revenge and save his sister. Finally, Tecumseh can arrives at village of colonists and he prepares to take revenge and saves his sister all right okay so now we're going to go through and kill the white man curious if they're going to have guns or if they're just going to be bow and arrows as well oh they've got guns this is going to be a bit more of a challenge isn't it but i imagine he's not going to be that smart oh he's a bit trickier if they are i'm a bit crappier so i can see two of them one that i couldn't hit at all or have you got a gun? I do find this game is really fun, easy and just really light-hearted. There is no challenge to it, unfortunately. I mean, the biggest challenge for me is the um, obstacles. That's, that's, uh, that was, that's the trickiest part for me in this game. But I'm guessing it is kind of funny that all these people are just being overpowered by this babe with a freaking bow and arrow. Well, they've got a gun. He could easily just shoot me from a distance. He could blow my freaking head off. But no, it's like, no, I'm just going to charge at you. And so am I. I'm going to just charge at you. Oh, more people for me to kill. Ah, hey, volunteer, I see. Come here and let me shoot you in the head. And you're dead. Also, how like, how many freaking arrows does this baby have? I think, I think, um... If there was like the amount of ammo you have um, and you had to go and collect like extra bits, maybe even craft them. I know, as I said, it's just such a simple game and I am, you know, asking far too much just for something which is meant to be, you know, very humorous. But I feel certain things like that would be, would just add to it and make it a little bit trickier. You'd have to think about things more rather than me just going, duh, 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 duh. done. Where's my sister? After the victory, to come some free the sister and together they return. So, so that's my sister. And me rescued her. Okay. If we must die, we die defending our rights. Okay, baby. The end. Right, guys. So that was Wounded Summer Baby. Um, I don't really know where to begin. It was fun. Funny even, but I feel the lack of challenge did take away from it. Even though I do appreciate it, it's trying to be humorous with the fact a nine-month-old took down an entire tribe and village. But I feel certain things like gathering your arrows so you actually at least need to think about how you approach a situation rather than firing them willy-nilly would really add to the game. Either way, it was a simple and fun game. So that is it for today, guys. But if you enjoyed the video, then please, please hit the like button. It really goes a long way and is greatly appreciated. And if you'd like to see more, then don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Otherwise, I'll see you next time. Thank you.